What is up guys, it's your boy Indie Gamer, bringing you guys a new video today. In today's video, we're going to be talking about everything that's going to be changed for the beta, also what's new coming to the beta for Weekend 2 for both users for PS4 and Xbox One uh, for in like two days, maybe even if we're lucky tomorrow, uh, they started up, start up the servers and stuff like that, that'd be awesome, uh, but hey, we're only like two days away. So let's get straight into this video. So the first thing that's coming is an increase of uh, level cap. Level cap will be at 40 uh, for everyone, for PS4 and for Xbox users. Uh, for Xbox users, you guys will be having to catch up because you guys will be starting at level 1. Uh, for PS4 users, your stats will carry over and you guys will be starting at 25 uh, from or wherever you guys left off in the weekend 1. So that's good if you guys leveled up to 25 and now it's just halfway through. For some of the other things that are changing, like the modes are will be changing for weekend two. Like for TDM, it's from 75 to 100 kills now. Uh, it's always been like this, but they're trying it out and seeing what's uh, the community likes better, 75 or 100. Most people wouldn't like 100, so that's will be changed for weekend two. Also for domination, uh, the kill score will be changing from 50 uh, to 100 per kill. So that's what everyone's been asking for, because uh, it takes forever to get just a UAV uh, in domination because the scores for kills is 50 points uh, so it was really ridiculous to get a UAV it freaking had to be a 10 streak to get a UAV so I'm happy about that you guys will be seeing so much more fun uh, streams for that so a few things that will be changed on uh, for weekend 2 on weapons and uh, equipment uh, will be that grenades will be getting a nerf just a little bit so it's not too crazy for weekend 2 and for the game release because from the feedback from everyone uh, this it's really hard to get away from grenades because we're boost on the ground so it's kind of a tad different compared to a bit of jetpacks where you can just boost out of their ways and stuff so they understand that and they will be getting a little tuned down uh, for weekend 2 also uh, for the center any rounds those will be on default off now so you're gonna have to if you want to use them you're gonna have to load them into your weapon now and that's even better also there might be a tab on uh, difference to the PPSA for weekend 2 uh, they just might not set it but they might have nerfed it just a little bit maybe with the SDG have been a little bit nerfed just so it's not too overpowering over like let's say the grease gun or the type 100 after on uh, the slow rate of fire so we can see a little bit difference in those weapons also uh, for weekend 2 it's not be the same as weekend 1 also from everyone that's complaining about the grease gun not being good Michael Condry said from the stats they're getting that it's the highest KD weapon out there right now so let's move on to kill streaks. So the changes coming to the kill streaks on weekend two will be the Molotovs will be going from two to one. So you will only get one Molotov per uh, time you earned it. Also, the paratroopers will be getting an increase. Uh, so they're I'm guessing probably be a little bit more stronger uh, than before, and maybe the spy plane will take more damage, or we don't know what coming up with spy planes but it will be changed also uh, maybe a green increase of health or maybe made it smaller or made it farther away so it's harder for us to damage it with rifles with one mag so let's talk about what's new coming to the beta for weekend 2 so for weekend 2 as we already talked about in the beginning the level cap will be moved to 40 also we will get new equipment new uniform new weapons new game modes new maps for weekend 2 and that's a lot of stuff for just one weekend uh, for the beta and that's crazy for them to add all that stuff for you guys so I'm gonna break down what you guys uh, will be receiving weekend 2 so weekend 2 will be getting a new map called Aachen and Aachen is actually pretty and uh, like nice map I mean, here's a preview of it as I talk over and give you guys more details about everything else that's coming uh, for weekend 2 uh, basically this map is like small to medium range uh, you guys will see a lot of sniper fire in the uh, middle also you guys will see a lot of uh, close quarter uh, fights in like the streets and stuff so that's a really good map uh, to have for beta to access and see how everything plays also the new game mode that we were receiving for the beta will be capture the flag uh, I, I apologize to everyone that I know you're heartbroken that we will not be getting search and destroy for the beta because everyone wants search and destroy that's fan favorite and they want to keep that for the release of the game to keep everyone at least something for look forward to 
So as you guys know, when the level cap is moved to 40, there is a lot of weapons and a lot of stuff that gets unlocked. So a lot of things we will be getting uh, for it, it's going to be basically new weapons like the M1A1 uh, carbine, at least that's what's announced uh, as a really good rifle. It's a uh, low recoil, three round uh, kill. Uh, rifle and it's pretty good at least from what they're saying. I will be putting uh, that to the test Also, there will be a new sniper rifle uh, And other other um, many weapons there will be that they did not announce uh, Also, there will be new uh, secondary also more uh, like lethal grenades and stuff like that and there will be more kill streaks added to it the flamethrower will be one of them that they did announce uh, will be coming for weekend 2 and there will be more few uniform changes you can change your uniforms and stuff uh, so that's kind of cool too that they're adding some uniform changes to it so overall for weekend 2 there is a lot of stuff that's coming uh, for both users for uh, Xbox users you guys get to grind it out and just play it all the way through for PS4 users we just continue on from where we left off and that's awesome too guys we will be getting a new level cap new map new mode and many many weapons and equipment and stuff to try out and uh, just demolish people and that's what we're going to be doing uh, basically for weekend two for long weekend here for Labor Day so I really do hope you uh, the beta does start up tomorrow and the servers are open so we can get a lot of streams and a lot of uh, gameplay to you guys uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this video and breakdown of like what uh, that's coming to you guys the information uh, if you guys did hit that like button for me and subscribe to the channel for more uh, news updates and contacts and just great gameplays of all kinds of video games and uh, mostly Call of Duty and Rainbow Six. But that's all I have for you guys in today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Much love and peace.